Hello everybody and welcome to the YouTube Shorts ARG YouTube channel. Uh, this is, uh, this might be, today and tomorrow might be the last videos until I remodel, or on that later. So, um, if you've been keeping on, like, up to date with the series, then you'll know Dan O'Cal draws, Johnny Razor, and a lot of other YouTubers have been collaborating and making the YouTube Shorts ARG. And... I have been covering it in three in a four slash five part series. This is part three out of four or five. So last, uh, just go watch the other two parts if you haven't. I'll just continue off the last video. So last video, I theorized that Riggy, uh, Joe Kane, and uh, Johnny Razor will f stop the war. But there's been a lot more information since my last video. It's begun with. Is our, uh, our computer, our brain in a computer? I don't know why it's named that. So, it's like this. Can we upload our brain into a computer? The concept of living forever. AI. It's all the latest videos have been all about AI. Ever is as old as time, yet unfortunately every single person who's dreamed of this over the years has died. But scientists wonder if there's a way to escape death by uploading our brain into a computer. So, is it possible? Well, in theory, scientists have concluded yes. Although, with a few minor caveats. Primarily, that we wouldn't actually be transferring ourselves into a computer. It would really just be the computer, or AI, making a clone. 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 Clone, clone of our brain. But the issues we face today is not only that we don't yet have the technology to scan the brain, but that we don't have the processing power to match the way our brains work. We have millions of synapses firing off at once to create our thoughts, and the supercomputer that would be needed to manage this is unfathomable. Although to be fair, computers used to take up a whole room, and now we've managed to shrink it into a laptop, and even further, a phone. So scientists believe that, with luck, we'll manage to have our whole brains and computers by 2045. And now you won't have to wonder. So that's the our brains and computer. That was all heavy on AI. You'll see a lot more AI in the other videos. So this is will AI rule the world? And well, it's how AI animation. would take over the world? With ChatGPT and AI art generation exploding recently, have you ever wondered exactly what an AI would do to end the world? Well, theoretically, let's say the AI was immediately plugged into the internet, fundamentally given the world's entire knowledge. First, the AI would most likely attempt to gain access to as much intel as possible, including the CIA, Secret Service, etc. So, if you missed it, the paper said, well, let me just go to it. So, uh, you could read it for yourself. It's just saying he will die, he will die, he will die. Yeah, just all that. Intel is possible, including the CIA, Secret Service, etc. So, it would know exactly how to topple our nation, spreading perfectly targeted misinformation. Uh, I don't know why this is here. I just wanted to, like, just show it. Information. Destroying peace treaties with other nations by leaking exposing documents. This is actually a little funny. Australia has a secret Twinkie formula. Might be true, I don't know. And by firing nuclear warheads on neighboring countries, causing them to fight back. All while doing this, it would have most likely taken control of our factories to serve its own purposes, generating its own armies and preparing to rid the world of all its imperfections, and above all else, rid the world of all humans, and anything else that stands in its way. But how do we know this is what AI would do? Well, because what I just read was actually ChatGPT's very own response to the question. Scary stuff. But that's... And that's... Will AI rule the world? And in the final video that you released today, as I'm recording this, easiest ways to make people hate you. There's tons of fictional villains, and while some are written to be, you could see like you could hear the glitches. You could see random pieces of paper popping up. Understood. Many are written to be downright hated. So what are the easiest ways to make someone hate a villain? Well, here's a quick list. First off, any sort of animal or child abuse. Immediately, you despise them for harming innocents. Displaying any sort of greed and overabundance of craziness or megalomania, as well as showing a lack of empathy or emotion, and obviously killing people. But one of the top... It says tomorrow. Tomorrow's the 23rd, which is when it would rather all get out of hand or finish more on that later ways that tv shows and movies are able to make you instantly hate a character is by having the villain simply overpower the main character riggy he's so done or either by abusing them or kidnapping them and taking their place okay that's it what? i know you know or what but i kidnapped riggy and i'm holding him hostage this shirt the best two shorts being about computers and ai you're just toying with me oh, well that's it you're done tomorrow riggy dies and now you're tomorrow my direct control. Come here! Wait, what? No, no. Uh, I don't know what this QR code is yet. I have a good hunch though. Easiest ways to make. And uh, that's the end of that video. On another note, this is 
Johnny Thunder's more recent videos. Last time, I think we watched, I figured out his schedule. This time, and it finally happened. This time, it's these two. Okay. I followed him. He just left. Um, he came to the woods, um, and there's this gravel path that he walked down. Um, I think, I think I know how to get rid of him. Okay. I have right here. You can barely see it because it's so dark out. It's a flash drive. It has a copy of the email that they used to hack us. He's going to try to stop it. Except it's the opposite. It's the reverse engineered version that, in theory, if I plug it in, should give everybody access to them. Should nullify all the stuff that they did to us. And hopefully we can get out of here. He's going to try to destroy the clones on the 30th. And I found it. Alright, I did it. I found it. This is the middle of the woods. It's just covered in trees. Okay. I'm going to have to Metal Gear Solid my way in there. And we plug this bad boy in. And, and, and we're, we're done. We, we finish this stupid clone saga. <laughs> I am so tired. You don't even understand how tired I am. Okay. Whoop. Wish me luck. And that was the video he released today. So tomorrow it's pretty much guaranteed that there's going to be the end of the ARG. And speaking of, like, the Clone Saga ending on the 2030, on the... 30th you will not guess who released the video joe kane released a video of him actually trying to stop it called the most important speedrun mp4 here it is okay i've got a message from riggy my friends have all been clones we need to riggy he knows we need to somehow find some sort of code and upload it to the clone VPN website. This might be the most important speedrun yet. Hey, hold it! Clones are designed to have one single purpose. To serve their master, whoever that is. To destroy the YouTube shorts as we know them. So the answer should be hidden somewhere in the shorts they made. Of course, the promo code. I knew the promo code was a code. I actually deciphered it all, but I couldn't figure out like where to put it. So I just gave up. Of course, the promo codes. Okay, I got the code. I have only one chance, but let's try it. Hell yeah, it worked. But maybe I should also decrypt it somehow. There could be a hidden message somewhere. But for now, the only thing left is to get to the facility. Though I'm stuck in Sweden, so I can't do much. Hi, how are the rest of your set? You hear that with me? For me. Bring it on! Somebody has to do it. The somebody is Johnny Razor. And uh, this is proof that it was Joe Kane and how it's unlisted. And this completes it all. I found this video while I was like searching for the most important speedrun. Shout out to Scott69. Here it is. I don't know what the date's for. I think that was like one of the speedruns or the live streams. Uh, I'm like, it's this video, like this one, was released two hours ago of the time of recording. So, I don't know. Where am I? Who are you? And why have you been following me? Questions, questions. How about I ask a question? Why do I exist? I feel pain, Rigmund. Pain because of you. Ugh, I hate it when people use my full name. Your Rigmund. Species is incorrect. An unnatural mixture of two creatures. A freak of nature. I got bullied about my tail enough in middle school. Be original. No. Lol. It's because of your tail that the great machine made me 
incorrect. But I don't hate your tail. Far from it. Once I have a tail of my own, I will be the perfect Riggy the Rabbit Monkey. Then I can control Denno and have him work for Clone VPN without even realizing it. Why waste energy cloning a human when we can just clone his small little mascot instead? Ha! Joke's on you! Denno and I hate each other, so he won't do anything you say! Actually, he already has. All I have to do is be nice to him. You're just always in annoyance. That's why he won't listen to you. Shoot. But I must be perfect. All clones must be perfect. So I'm going to fix, fix it. I need a tail. <laughs> so what, are you gonna grow one? No, I'm going to take yours. Uh, something tells me that's gonna be painful. Not for me. How are you doing that fancy stuff with your hands? Those who use the teleporter gain abilities so we can treat the world's environments how we wish. Whoa, can I do that? No. But I teleported! Unwillingly. You were misplaced. The week before we took control, we scattered you creators across the internet. That way, when we slipped in, no one batted an eye. No fair! I wanna do that! Child. You sound like my dad. However, I am special. Because the machine burned down when I was created, now I can manipulate other objects as well. Pulling them in and out of reality like toys. Whoa! So are you like a genie? What? No. I wish for a thousand wishes and a bunch of money and to be world famous! Actually, just kidding. I'm already famous. I have 1.5 million subscribers on YouTube. <laughs> I'm basically the most famous person in the world. How did I... Sorry, uh, let me continue. You frustrate me. Oh, the alarm. I must stick to the schedule. I will return, and then we can begin. Wait, 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 don't leave me! No! Okay, is he gone? Ha! Alright, just like the prison break, let's do this. I just love the scene. anyone there? Hello? Wait, what? Royal Pear? Is that you? Dude, I'm sorry I have to tie you up. My boss will kill me if I don't. This is my channel. I just got to 500,000 subs. You can't do this to me now. I don't want to, but my life is on the line. I really like you, but orders are orders. Sorry, man. I gotta go. Wait, don't leave me here. Hey, I'm here to save you. Hold on. Mwah. Thank you. I don't have arms, so I couldn't untie the rope. Wait, he doesn't have arms either. How did he tie you up? Lol. Never mind. Come on, let's go. Uh, where are you going? Uh, escaping? How do you know where the exit is? I don't. How do you know no one's guarding? I don't. That's why you're coming. What? So I can use you as a shield if I need to. <sighs> Lol. But, like, that's pretty much the whole video. So. That's where did Ricky go? MP4? Um... Also, I'd just like to give a little shout-out and, like, a little information. So, uh, I'd like to give a quick shout-out to NooniTU5YB for telling me that the QR code from my uh, Part 2 video is not a live stream. It's a phone call that, that the clones do not want to create shorts. More on that later. And another shout-out to... Oh, what's wrong with me? That's, like, that's his name. Keep up the good work. And the max, masked man is named Robert Dizabuki. I asked him how he, how does he know. Thanks. He said he said too much. Um, I uh, don't know how he knows that. i like, not sure. So in Royal Pair's newest videos, it said this. Freezing called Doritos? No way, is he gonna eat a bomb? That's insane. Dog, I don't want to react to this shit. Why are you making me do this? It gets views. That's all that matters. But this time- That's Robert Dizabuki, aka the Masked Man. This type of content is dog shit. There's no originality to it. That may be true, but we made you for a reason. Aka the Masked Man, I don't think I continue that sentence. Do your job like the other clones or else you're cut. Okay, chill out. I I'll do it. Freezing cold Cheetos? Wow, that's insane. I can't believe he ate that. Google Gaga. <laughs> okay, dog, I can't do this. I actually want to kill myself. Please, let me do something else. I can't let you do that. What happened to me just making the content that Pear was already making? It was original and funny and- Look, we're a business. Our only job is to get the- He really likes Royal Pear. 
lose and make money. This formula works. You don't understand. This isn't right. Listen, I'm trying my best. It could have been worse. The boss wanted you to rebrand as a dog and be really loud and annoying. So just be glad I talked him out of it. Oh, yeah? Well, what if I just tell everyone not to buy Clone VPN? That's it. Tomorrow you're reading Twitter memes in front of Minecraft Parkour. Wait, wait, wait. And that's what happens. You wake up as Taylor Swift. What's the first thing you do? Kill like three people. Just came back from Oppenheimer. Not great, not terrible. They both have the same voice actor. Bro, I swear to God, the funniest shit just happened in game. So I play Destiny, right? I haven't even told the story yet. All right, shut this off. I got a new batch of memes. Clone VPN wants you to use. What? I can't even use my own memes? It's not up to me, man. Boss's orders. All right, let's see what you got. Teaching got me like... Bro, what? Okay, we'll just move on. There's no tired, like, teacher tired. Bro, what is this? My target audience isn't teachers. This meme makes no sense. Wait, wait, hold on. These memes aren't just for teachers. Dog, it's from teachermemes.com. Let me just choose my own memes. All right, but if you mess up, you're cut. Fine, j just look at this one. One day I sing it, yeah, yeah. One month I sing it, yeah, yeah. One year I sing it. <clears throat> Bobby, Bobby. So you're telling me people of your generation find this funny? Well, kinda. Here, this one's better. No, I've seen enough. You're cut. Wait, 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 no, no, no. At least come to the stream on the 29th. You wait. 29th. That's the stream today. Videos. Oh. I can't find the uh, live. My final stream, but by the time of recording, it's not here yet. In the comments, please tell me information. So that's all I have to review. Time for theories, as always. Here, so, my theories are. So, uh, I'm finally going to answer why they are doing it. I've been keeping that off for so long. So, I think Robert Dezabuki, I think I sang his name right. I think he hates how people of this generation like, don't value anything about the create like YouTube shorts. He wants to get rid of YouTube shorts for good. And I think that Johnny Vazor, Riggy, Royal Pair, Royal Pair Clone, and more will fight back. And I also don't know what's happening to Funded and Failure. It's not that exciting. There's barely any lore. Yeah. And uh, time for the thing that you haven't been waiting for, but I still am going to say it. I'm thinking of completely changing the channel. I want to like completely reboot the channel. I want to be called. I want to change the channel to Theorizer. This is already my new profile picture. And it's been for a little while now. If my channel gets at least 65 subscribers, then it'll happen. Because the, once the ARG ends, what do I have left? I'll be theorizing for anything. Just leave a comment. Please, share this video, I need to get more subscribers. I want to continue making these theory videos. They're really fun. I see why MatPat has like four channels and posts weekly. Like, I can't keep up with that post schedule. But all I need is 65 new subscribers. 65. It sounds like a lot, but I'm like, I already have 30 subscribers, so I'm basically halfway there. But halfway and a quarter yeah no halfway and halfway and a half half a half so um at least like get my video more views more likes more views subscribers and uh, who knows maybe matpat will see this but and uh, if you guys have any idea for a catchphrase please i need to know and here see uh catch you on the flip side i don't know and uh, you, there, is, there might be a video tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. I'll also re I'm also gonna be getting more ideas for the assign uh, for this new reboot. So give me ideas.